So this morning I was able to get a hold of Bioshock Collection and I must say it does look pretty good, it does look small improvements, the frames of course are a lot higher, it's in 1080p but it's come to my attention that some things are still within the game and it's an infinite money glitch. So as you can see we're at Eternal Flame and Surgical Savings and if you follow this path you will go to a specific room where you're able to do this glitch or exploit. So by following this path, you'll go there. Now you will need telekinesis for this. It's very important that you have it because over there on that little key hook, there will be a key, a, uh, key card place. You will use telekinesis to grab it and uh, use it to access this door. And once you're in, you'll be able to hack that camera over there. There'll be a splicer in here that you can kill. And there'll be a camera over there that you can hack, but I destroyed it anyway. And as you can see, there's a lot of water in this area, which will become very useful after the glitch has been placed. But, but upon pressing this door control button, it will spawn a splicer. Which you can then kill with water in that particular area. Now, it, it will help to have a lot of EVE carried around on you for this specific glitch. As you can see, there's quite a few bodies in here already. But with this, with this glitch, you're able to press a button as many times as you want. We'll say like five times. And in that area, they'll spawn even more splices. And then you can just shock the water around them. Go in, pick up as many things as you want. They, they don't just drop money, they also drop bullets. And then just press it, say, another ten times. Might make the game slow down a little bit, depending on how many people are actually in there. But when you shock the floor, and they all eventually die, then all the frames will be at normal again. But look how many bodies are in here this time. There's more than ten, at least. And then you just go inside, and just spam the A button so you can collect everything that's in here. Every single bullet, all the money. And of course it'll get to a point where you can't pick any more up. I killed myself there. I mean it's not a huge exploit, it's not like it's going to really break the game anyway. It, ju it just means you can spawn an infinite amount of splices as many times as you want and just get as much money as you need. I believe there is a money cap of $500 which I don't see the point when there's of course four digits right there. As you can see, I've reached the official amount of money, which is actually $500. I don't see why it should be. Well, let's see how many button presses it takes until we actually, uh, until the game decides to lag really badly. Press that 20 times now. Pressed it about 40 times. There's quite a lot in there. The frames are dropping really badly now. Oh my god. Oh my god. The frame rate. It's... Oh my god. Look, the entire floor is now covered in splices. Some of them are actually phased inside of each other. It's that glitched. The purpose of this video wasn't really to show any new glitches or anything. It was just to show that this glitch uh, somehow still exists. As there is many videos actually covering this area of the game. I don't know if there's any other glitches. This is just the one that I, I knew of from when I started playing the game. And the glitch still works to this very day. Master Control Assault Rifle Skin and Battle Rifle Skin. I'm very lucky, very lucky to get them two items within the same pack. So I feel like, I think I've got all of the Master Control Skins now, and they're all rares, so that's really good.